As both a yoga instructor and a chef, I place a lot of demands on my body. Almost everything I like to do requires a lot of strength and energy. So to help my body perform the best it can, I give it the best fuel I possibly can. And part of how I do that is with juicing. Eating whole fruits and vegetables is great, but sometimes I want a really concentrated shot of nutrition. And of course, it still has to taste good. That's what's great about juicing. Juicing allows you to get super concentrated levels of vitamins and minerals without eating impractical amounts of food. When you eat whole fruits and vegetables, the material must go through your entire digestive process in order to extract the nutrients. This takes time and it also taxes your body because it has to divert energy and blood to the digestive system in order to extract the nutrients. And that's fine if you want to eat like one apple or one orange, but let's say you want the nutritional benefit of four apples or half a dozen oranges, then eating all that can be a challenge. Now if you juice your fruits and veggies, your stomach can absorb the nutrients much more easily. There's no added strain to your digestive system, and it just takes a few minutes to juice pounds of produce. It would take quite some time and energy to actually eat all of that, but once it's juiced, you can drink it in a single glass. There are four main styles of juicers that are on the market, and the differences can be a little confusing, so I thought it would be good to explain the differences so that you can make an informed decision about which kind is best for you. Let's take a closer look at each one of these Omega juicers. The first style is a centrifugal style juicer. This juicer uses centrifugal force to spin the juice out of the ground pulp. Think of it like you would a traditional washing machine on the spin cycle. This basket is vertical, so it can keep the pulp in the basket until you clean it out. It's the most efficient juicer you can purchase, and it's quiet. It works best with harder fruits and veggies like apples and carrots, and it will even juice some leafy greens. So let's make some juice. I'm going to use apple, ginger, some lime, really brightens it up, and carrots, really healthy. Okay, I'm going to start off by cutting the apple. And I'm going to cut it into a little bit smaller pieces. There. And then cut off a piece of ginger. Gives it a nice zesty flavor. All right, I'm going to turn the machine on. can't wait to try this juice. It smells amazing. That ginger is so aromatic. Oh, that's delicious. Mmm. Really bright and fresh. Mmm. Of all the juicers available, this one is the easiest to clean. You just open the basket. And then I unscrew the part on the inside and I can take out the blade. There. Out comes the basket. And then I take out the biodegradable liner and it has all of the leftover material attached to it. See, and this is how easy it is to pull it out. Look. I just kind of fold it in half and then fold it right over and out it comes. Right into my compost bowl, see? It couldn't be easier. This next style is a pulp ejection juicer. The angled basket ejects the pulp into a separate bin so you can continuously juice without having to stop and empty the basket. This juicer can handle a wide range of fruits and vegetables and the large opening means less prep. Also, most items you can put in whole. There are a lot of lesser quality juicers of this style on the market and sometimes the pulp ejection juicer gets a bad rap but this Omega version is much quieter than most, and it's nearly as efficient as the centrifugal juicer. Not to mention, it's also a great value. So let's make some juice. I'm going to use apple, kale, and a variety of vegetables. Okay, so I'm going to start by cutting the apple into quarters. 
And I think that'll be the perfect size to fit in that nice large opening. Okay, just gonna turn it on. There, see how easy that was? All right. Now here's the best part. I get to drink the juice. Mmm. That is so delicious. Mmm. All right, so I'm gonna show you just how much juice we got out of those fruits and vegetables. Look at that. See how dry it is? That's because we got all the juice out.